Hello and welcome. In this tutorial, you'll learn how to set up your printer to scan documents and images directly to a computer using the SNB, Cerner Message Block protocol. This is a powerful method that allows your printer to save scanned files to a shared folder on your computer, eliminating the need for flash drives or email. By the end of this guide, you'll have a seamless workflow for all your scanning needs. Let's get started. Check your IP address. To check your computer's IP address, you first need to open the command prompt. Then, type ipconfig to display your computer's IP address. Go to your develop or Konica Minolta machine. Tap utility. Go to administrator settings. Enter administrator's password. Go to Network Settings, and then TCP IP Settings. Tap TCP IP Settings 1. You can manually assign IP address, or use the automatic DCHP. For network printers, manually setting a static IP is generally better, because it ensures a consistent, predictable connection. Be sure to input unique IP address when setting manually. Add also the subnet mask and default gateway, same with your computer. Click OK to finish. To display device information and to see and confirm the IP address, simply tap the device information. Go back to your computer, type ping space IP address of the device. This is to verify the availability of a destination IP address. When the target device receives the request from the computer, it immediately sends back echo reply packet. When there are packets of data received, it means that a device is online and can be reached from your computer. Next, open computer settings. Go to Network and Internet on the sidebar. Click Advanced Network Settings, then click Advanced Sharing Settings. Turn on Network Discovery and File and Printer Sharing. Next, go to Account Settings, Other User. Add a local account if your computer does not have one. Go to Sign In Options to add a user password. After creating a password, go to Turn Windows Feature On and Off. See the SMB feature and check the box. Click OK to enable the SMB feature. And then restart the computer. Open Google Chrome and type the device's IP address and press enter to open the web connection. Go to the store address menu. Click new registration. Select SMB function. Enter a name. In the destination information, check the Please enter a host home. Or you can use the computer's IP address if you prefer not to use the host name. To get the host name of a computer, open command prompt and type host name. Enter the host name. On the file path, enter the shared folder name. 
Let's first create a scan folder and share it. Create a folder in the specified location. After creating a folder, right-click the folder and select Properties. Go to the Sharing tab and click the Share button. Type Everyone and click on Add. Choose Read Write on Permission Level and click Share and click Done. Click on Advanced Sharing. Tick Share this folder and select Permission. Tick Allow Full Permission and click on Apply and OK. Go back to the web connection and enter the folder's name. Then, enter the username and password of the computer. Click OK to register the user. Open your scan folder. Go to the machine to start scanning. Place the original in the automatic document feeder. On the panel, open Scan to PC. Select the account name created earlier. You can change the color, resolution, and file type. You can also enter the file name. Press Start to scan. Go to Job List to confirm if the scanning is complete. You can also scan double-sided documents automatically. Go back to your computer and check the scan documents in the folder. <laughs>